Hey, want to thank you all for tuning in, logging on to another episode of Illuminati News Hour. Right here on Illuminati Radio, I'm your host, I'm your pastor, Mr. Michael Smith. My co-host is Brother Lamik Israel. If you are new to this channel, please hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell so you'll be notified when we drop this juicy news. Also, hit that like button and check out the description box for a whole lot of goodies. Okay, so the weekend I got a messed up face. Um, uh, the ritual, uh, the weekend, the weekend that got a ritual face. Just days after he drops his album, he got a ritual face. This is a ritual face, people. A ritual face. You know what I'm saying? Kind of like Michael Jackson and the Pepsi commercial. Go ahead, brother Israel. Let me hear this. This comes from NewYorkPost.com. Article headline: The weekend shows real face after plastic surgery shock. Fans. The yeah. weekend is feeling his own face again. In a new ad for Pepsi ahead of his big Super Bowl halftime performance, the 30 year old singer opted to ditch his cryptic bandages and CGI plastic surgery, showing off his real face for the first time in a while. The one minute teaser for the show on February 7th. Shows a montage of fans enjoying songs, finding lights, including grocery store worker and a pool cleaner dancing to his tunes like no one's watching. At, right at the time, the weekend flashes a smile to a tofu security guard who was interrupted, grooving to the head. This is the first time in a while fans got to see his real face since the weekend, whose real name is Abel Chesfang has been donning, donning bandages as part of an aesthetic for his latest album. And as Variety noted, this is the first Pepsi ad dropped before Super Bowl Sunday, which airs on CBS and the first time the performer participated in one. So, he dropped his album before his face revealing... And he also is going to be performing on Super Bowl Sunday. So in exchange for that, you know what I'm saying? He got to get his face messed up. If you can sacrifice a body, then I guess you'll sacrifice your face. Go ahead, Brother Israel. Recently, The weekend dropped a music video for his song, new song, Save Your Tears, sporting some disturbing alterations to his face, akin to extreme plastic surgery. But then you saw me, caught you by surprise, he aptly sings in a video in which the, the, he displays a thin and crooked nose, bloated cheeks, puffed up lips, surgery scars, and other horrific new features. These are the rituals, people. These are the rituals. This is what had to be done in order for him to further his career. You know what I'm saying? I guess you know what I'm saying. What what he trying? What he gonna make a, a statement? Ugly niggas get love too now. He's changing it around. You know what I'm saying? It used to be all about the pretty get get niggas. Now is ugly niggas get love too now? That bitch see a love too. <laughs> Go ahead, brother. Fans speculate that it was shade for not being nominated at the 2021 Grammy Awards, but other fans took it as a diss to ex girlfriend Bella Hadid. However, fans shouldn't be alarmed. The disturbing new look was achieved through prosthetics and CGI. He has previously worked with prosthetics. Re- Renaissance, a makeup effect studio that is taking credit for a transformation on social media. The weekend has been using his face as a way, as a way, as a statement, including a battered aesthetic in a short film after hours, which, hold on, there's no pop up, so I'm gonna pop up and mess me up which has the same name as his most recent album. The music video for Blinding Lights featured his post vendor bloody and bruised mug, a look he recreated for the MTV Video Music Awards.
Awards last August, and in November he covered his face again. His again batter face with surgical dressing to accept an award on stage at the music at the American Music Awards. As for Super Bowl LV, what number is that in Roman? Uh, I don't know. I'm not a oh, Roman. Oh, oh. Um, let's see, Super Bowl 52. 55. Okay, okay, because I know Super Bowl 52, and then I was counting now. Okay, so Super Bowl 55. It's unclear what face the weekend will be showing. And that's the end of the article. Alright, yeah, this is a ritual, people. And this is the price of fame. Either sacrifice your loved one, or you sacrifice something on your body. Sometimes your face. Sometimes you do the stinky leg with little Bootsy. Either, neither, or you still got to sacrifice something. This is news. I want to thank you all for tuning in, logging on to another episode of Illuminati News Hour right here, Illuminati Radio. I'm your host. I'm your pastor, Mr. Michael Smith. My co-host is Brother Lami Israel. If you are new to this page channel, please hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell so you'll be notified when I drop this juicy news. Hit that like button. Also, if you want to... Oh, don't forget, in the description box, there's a whole bunch of goodies. So, go check that description box for the goodies. And if you want to join my exclusive Facebook Messenger group, you can do so by sending me a friend request to my Facebook page, which is P.S. T.R. Michael Smith on Facebook, and I'll add you to the group. Till next time, stay tuned. God bless you.